In this video, I'm going to show you how to install QGIS for Windows. Um, so just start by getting the internet open, and we're just going to Google download QGIS. And we can come to this link, download.qgis.org. Um, and you can see they have the latest release or the long-term release. Um, it doesn't really matter which one, which one you do. This is for, for new users. Uh, so we'll do this. And if you have a 64-bit operating system, uh, you should download the 64-bit version. They also have uh, the advanced install down here. Okay. Um, and so what we're going to do is we'll just install this latest release here, the two, version 2.18 64-bit. So I'm going to click on this, and it's waiting. Waiting. Hopefully my internet. Uh, we can just close this message. We don't need to donate right now. Pages still loading. There we go. Now it's come up uh, to download this executable file. And I'm going to click save. This is in my downloads folder. And it's going to take just a little bit to download this. Uh, here we go. Okay. Almost there. That's download. I'm going to open this executable file which I can do by clicking just on this uh, icon down here. There we go. And so now it pops this up that I want to allow this app to make changes. I'm going to say yes. And then it gives me uh, this setup wizard. So next, I agree to the license installed in this folder. Um, these are sample data sets you can choose to download. I'm not going to, um, but if you want to, it's better just, it'll just download data that you can use for examples. Uh, so now this is going to take a little while to download. I'm going to stop the video while this happens, and then we'll come back once it's all downloaded and uh, walk through some of QGIS. Okay, so we're back. Um, it's finished installing. I have my installer here still. I am just going to click finish. Okay, now we should be able to pop up my programs and uh, I still have an old install showing up here, but I installed uh, QGIS, I want to go to desktop 2.18.7, that's the one I just installed. Um, we will click on that and it's opening in the other window so you can't see it. I'll pull it over once it opens up. Uh, we'll go through some things. It'll take a minute to load and then it will say it'll be ready. Okay. And here we go. So now we have QGIS open and it remembers all the stuff that I had in my older installs. And so you can see that I have this document here I could open. But that's how you get QGIS installed. Um, I'll do uh, another video on some other things about QGIS.